when using Blender for 3D printing or creating models to a specific measurement, then we must change the scale. That can be done from the scene. So we go over here, scene properties, click on that, we have the scale in here. If we expand the units, you can see we have unit scale and the length. These both need to be changed. So we change the length to millimeters. We also must be in a new system of metric. And the scale here. So we'll change this to 0.001, which will be in millimeters. 0.01 will be centimeters or 10 millimeters. 0.1, 100 millimeters and 1,000 millimeters. So this is always 0.001. The other thing that we need to change is our grid. As you can see, our grid, well, it's no longer there. If we come up to the top and drop down the show overlays, we've got the scale of the grid in here. So we need to change that to the same scale. So 0.001. And you can see the scale has changed in here as well. To save this, we come up to File, Defaults, and Save Startup File. Click that, click again for OK, and it's all saved. Now when we quit Blender, File Quit, and come back in, we can see where our preferences have been saved. So if we look at the scene, which was last left open, you can see them all in here. So it's all been saved, ready to go. Now, when we add something like a cube, let's delete that one, add meshes and cube. Then when we select it and look at this add cube down here, you can see everything is in millimeters. We can change the scale of this to 20 millimeters. And we just zoom out. So that's how to change the scale in Blender. I hope you found that useful and I hope to see you again soon. If you're enjoying these videos and you would like to support the channel, then you can do so via my Ko-Fi page. That's at ko-fi.com forward slash MJ3D Studio. Any donations will be used to help to span the channel. I'd like to thank you all for watching and I hope to see you again soon.